Hi, I'm Kate Pierce, and I'm just so grateful to have had the opportunity to play softball here at Kickapoo for the past four years. Both my teammates and my coaches have made this experience one that is so incredible and one that I will cherish forever. I wanna start by thanking my parents. To my mom, thank you for supporting me through the ups and downs, the good games and the bad games, and helping me balance school and softball. And also thank you so much for washing my terribly dirty uniforms that turned brown after just one game. And to my dad, thank you for being the best coach all the way from T-ball to today. You always have the best advice and have shaped me into the person and the player that I am now. I love you both so much and I can't thank you enough for all that you have done for me. And to both my dad and John Facklum, thank you for getting a team together of a bunch of little girls going to Kickapoo High School and building up the program to what it is now. I don't know where it would be without you. And to Chris Facklum, my second mom, thank you for always being there for me and supporting me and for being the best vice president of the Booster Club ever. And to the rest of the Booster Club, Diane Muldoon, Lydia Akers, and the DeVores, thank you so much for all the snacks, the, the banners, the meals after games, and all of the gifts and the support that you have shown this program for the past four years. Also, thank you to Ryan Harrell and Mark Harrell. Ryan, thank you for the announcing, and Mark, thank you for those amazing pictures. We all loved looking at them very much. And a special shout out goes to Melissa Dancy for always having the mayonnaise for me to put on my Jersey Mike sandwiches after games. I honestly don't know what I would do without you. And last but not least, thank you to all of my coaches. Coach Jarman, thank you for letting me come to your academy. You have taught me so much about catching and helped me become the catcher that I am to this day. I know you don't like thank yous, but I am so grateful and thankful that you have been able to coach me all throughout high school and actually coach softball this year. To Coach Turner, thank you for sticking with me and my blue tennis shoes since eighth grade. You have not only helped me develop physically, but also mentally with my mental aspect of softball. Um, I can't thank you enough for all of those winter hitting sessions and those summer tournaments and just throughout fall as well. And to Coach Hauser, thank you so much for having confidence in me. You have instilled confidence in myself because of how you coached me. I can't thank you enough for just all that you have done for this program and for me as a player as well. I've had such an, an amazing time playing for all three of you. And I have also had a great time with all of my teammates as well. Not many people get the opportunity to play with their sisters or their cousins, but I got the opportunity to do both. So a special shout out to Carly and Sid. Thank you guys for being there for me throughout this um, season and through just everything. I love you both. And from just being locked in a shed to the karaoke bus parties and to dancing on the field, I am so grateful to have been a part of this Kickapoo High School softball team. Thank you. Uh, you probably don't expect me to say a huge long speech since I always get told how quiet I am, so I'm just gonna make this really short and sweet. Uh, I can't believe I made it here to my last softball banquet and now I'm the senior. It's hard to put into words how grateful I am for every single memory and relationship I've made playing softball for the last four years here at Kickapoo. First of all, I want to thank my coaches for not just coaching me because that's their job, of course, but for also supporting me and believing in me ever since the beginning. Coach Jarman, thank you for all your personal advice to help not only me, but everyone on the team improve in every aspect of the game. I wish I could have gotten the chance to spend more than just one season with you, but you really helped make my senior year one of the best. Coach Turner, thank you for coaching me not only through softball, but in life as well. I'm going to miss spending every single summer and school season playing softball with you. And I thank you for all the time you've spent truly helping me become the best player that I could. Coach Hauser, thank you so much for always believing in me. I've never had another coach like you. And don't worry, I mean that in a good way. You're one of the wisest people I know. And I'll never forget all the life lessons you have taught us that have helped us, that have helped us both on and off the field. I will miss your subtle jokes and your humor that comes out every once in a while, and it was such a pleasure to get to play for you and this team for the last four years. 
And of course, I have to thank John and Shane for coaching me and supporting me since I was very little. I can't imagine softball without you guys in it, and I'm so incredibly thankful for you guys. And next, I have to thank all my teammates who have made the last four years the absolute best. I will never forget all the memories and laughs we've had over the years, and I can't imagine playing without you guys by my side. Thank you for always being there through me through all the ups and downs, and I love you guys so much, and I'll miss you all so much next year. Lastly, I have to thank my parents, of course, for getting me started in softball when I was just five years old. Thank you for all the time you spent going to tournaments and games all summer and all school season when you probably had much better things to do. You guys are the reason I got to make all these amazing memories, and I will forever be grateful. And to all the other classmen, I know you've probably heard this a million times, and you don't really believe it because I didn't believe it either, but take advantage of every single moment and every memory made because it will be over in just a blink of an eye. Thank you all for everything. Hi, I am Megan Dancy. Softball has been such a huge part of my life for as long as I can remember. I have played softball since I was five years old, and now that it is over, I am realizing just how much I have gained from it. It has taught me how hard work and dedication can help not only on a sports team, but in everyday life. I will use the skills I have developed playing softball, such as teamwork, mental toughness, and of course, having energy in my future. But it would not have been possible for me to get to where I am without a few special people. I want to say a huge thank you to all of my coaches who have supported me along the way. Thank you, Coach Jarman, for the amazing and inspirational pep talks before I and O and deciding to coach our team this year. It wouldn't have been the same without you. Thank you, Coach Turner, for always being willing to help me in any way you could. You have taught me that doing the little things right will always pay off. Also, thank you for not getting mad at me whenever I would get Taco Bell before games. Coach Hauser, all four years, I have looked up to you and you have been such an inspiration to me. You have taught me so many life lessons and I would never have gotten to where I was playing softball if it was not for you. Thank you for being the best coach I could have ever asked for. Also, shout out to Coach Harrison for always hitting me with pitches during front toss. Thank you, Booster Club parents, for everything you have done for this program and the time that you take out of your day to do it. Kickapoo's softball program simply wouldn't function without all of you. I want to say thank you to my parents and the rest of my family. Throughout all four years, my mom has been at every single game I have ever played. Thank you for taking me to all my games and all the tournaments. Thank you for being there for me since I was five years old playing t-ball. My dad has taken off work countless times to come to my games, and even at work would be watching my games from his computer. Thank you for working on my hitting with me. You're the only person that has ever been able to pull me out of a slump. I wanna also thank my grandparents for being at every game they could be at, no matter how far of a drive. I hope you all know how much I appreciate your support. And finally, I want to thank my teammates. I have made some lifelong friendships playing softball. It would not have been the same without our dance battles, inside jokes, and of course, Lynn. Softball has given me some memories I will never forget. It wouldn't trade for the world. So I guess my last thank you goes to softball itself for being the best thing that has ever happened to me. I'm going to be completely honest. This is a part of playing softball all four years I wasn't looking forward to. I guarantee that I'll think back on this speech in a few days and remember something else I wish I would have said. I want to say thank you to the coaches, my teammates throughout all four years, the amazing district club, and my parents for allowing me to be gone all the time in the fall. Coach Turner, thank you for doing a great job of teaching me during the summers and throughout the fall seasons. I learned a lot about softball through the past four summers. Coach Harrison may not be here now, and he was quiet when he was here, but he made us all laugh and was someone we could joke around with. Coach Jarman, you came in this year and coached softball for the first time and did an amazing job. I think I can speak for everyone when we, when I say we truly fell in love with having you as our coach and having Kaylee with us in the dugout. Thank you for picking my head up and joking with me. Last but definitely not least, Coach Hauser. Thank you for being an amazing head coach, teacher, and friend. You taught us about life, softball, and history all in one season. Thank you for taking me everywhere with the team since freshman year. I loved every minute of it and will never forget it. Also want to thank, say thank you for taking me everywhere even when I found out my season was basically over. It meant a lot to still be able to go everywhere. To 
to my amazing teammates, thank you for a great senior year. Whether I was on the field playing by your side or cheering you on in the dugout, I wouldn't change a thing. Being stuck on the sidelines is hard, especially for me, because I always wanted to be out there and help as much as I could. My time on the field may have gotten cut and short, but I have always enjoyed cheering y'all on and watching y'all make amazing plays. I have the best teammates and wouldn't want to be on any other team. To the underclassmen, enjoy the moments you have. Take pride in being on such an amazing team. And trust me when I say that these four years go by fast. And before you know it, you'll be here giving a speech on some of the best times in your high school years. A phrase Coach Hauser repeated a lot last year was, play every game like it's your last because you never know when it might be. I thought about this, I've thought about this a lot since September 14th, and you really don't know when your last game will be. Enjoy these four years because they will be over before you know it, and you'll be asked what your plans are after you graduate. Hi, I'm Caitlin Hodges, and softball has been a huge part of my life for many years. It's what I always look forward to daily. While it had its ups and downs, it was an escape from the world. Any former softball player knows how it feels to play that last game. It's almost like a breakup, hard and heart-wrenching. You miss it every day and talk about it like it was just yesterday that you were playing and running bases after hitting a home run or sliding into home on a close play and being called safe. There is no way to describe the feeling that you get after a play like that. If you are still playing, hold it close to your heart and play every game like it was your last. Don't take it for granted. We have all done well this season and it's important to remember that we've learned some very valuable lessons. One of the great things about this sport is that there's always room for improvement so we can all work on doing something just a little better. When everyone does that, the results can be amazing. And if there's a, and if there's one thing I know about each and every one of you, it's that there isn't anyone who wouldn't give their all for the team. My favorite memory was having the opportunity each and every day to be a part of the team that was much bigger than myself and was focused on supporting and loving each other. My advice for, f for future players is to live in the moment and give 110% each day, both on the field and in the classroom. I want to thank all the people that made this season possible for me as well as for everyone else on the team. I want to thank the administration and all of the people, all of the behind the scenes work that they do for us athletes. It is very notable and I don't think they get the credit that they deserve. Our athletics administration works hard to give the athletes at the school the tools they need to be successful, not only in school and sports, but in life after school. So thank you. Coaches, thank you so much for everything you have done for me this year. You took a huge chance on me and I can't even begin to explain how much I appreciate it. I wouldn't have been able to continue playing the sport I love if it wasn't for you and your faith in me. Starting this year, I was a little fish in a big pond. I was fighting for something I never had to fight for in my life, which was a spot to play. Because of you, I have grown into the player and person that I am today, and I can't thank you enough for that. Thank you, coaches, for not only teaching us new things to help, but for believing in all of us. Your efforts to give me a great high school athletic athlete experience has never gone unnoticed, and I will never be able to completely explain how much I appreciate it. And now for the team. I don't even know where to begin with all of you. I have met some of the most amazing girls playing this sport. To, to all the teammates that have ever touched my heart, my career as a high school athlete wouldn't have been the same without you. Through the good and bad days, you all were always there to pick me up or settle me down. The friendships I've made with you all are the most priceless gifts I can take away from this experience. Thank you for being my teammates and letting me be a part of the team. Thank you for keeping me humble, in check, and being the greatest friend I could ever ask for. I'll never be able to thank you and show as much appreciation as you deserve. And now, Mom, you have been my biggest fan for my entire life. The endless lessons, tournaments, and traveling you have done just to support me is something that I will never be able to repay you for. Your happiness when I play well is always more exciting than actually playing well because it makes me feel like my hard work is paying off. And your comfort after a rough day is one of the only things that ever makes me feel better. You have put in just as much effort into my athletic and academic success as I have, if not more, and the gratitude I have for that will never be justifiably expressed. You're amazing and nothing I've ever done would ever or would have been possible without you. Thank you for being the best supporter a player could ask for. As seniors, we have been touched and changed by so many. Our time as high school athletes has come to an end and we have to remember the great times that we had. Remember who was there and who made it possible and make sure to thank them because our careers as athletes would have been nothing without everyone that was along for the ride. So thank you, all of you. Let's make some noise!
front car.